Nick is very technical, cool. James, even being English, he was very emotional. He'd come in my motorhome. We fought every race. Hammers, can I use your toilet? Say, James, come on. <laughs> With one epic win under his belt, Hunt left the teddy bear behind for a chance at the title. He signed with the 74 world champion constructor, McLaren. Those days, you've got five years with the death rate and everything else. He had a new future. The McLaren outfit was very structured. Everybody wore uniforms, but James just wore whatever he wanted. While Lauda took the role of champion, leading the charge for safety in the driver's union, Hunt became the new face of Formula One. I don't know whether the drivers today go out and a party till three o'clock in the morning and jump into the car. Who else could do that? I don't think you can get to that level being, you know, just who you want to be. You have to be, to a certain extent, what, what a racing driver is supposed to be, you know, quick. Hunt took pole position in qualifying for the first two races in 1976. While Lauda took the checkered flag. I think they respected each other, but there was a need. Nicky really wanted to be a cool guy, and he wasn't quite a cool guy, and he used to wind James up whenever he had the opportunity. What about this fellow James Hunt this weekend? Uh, James Hunt won his Grand Prix in Holland, so I think he's a very, very strong competitor now. <laughs> Nicky would psych the other drivers out just by talking to them, I mean. <laughs> Hunt's first win came in Spain, but it was taken down when the wing in his car was judged too wide. I don't know how wide it is anyway. You know? I didn't even know there was a rule about it. I just drive the damn thing. <laughs> In Monaco, Lauda took the lead at the first turn and never looked back. It was his fourth win and six starts. He didn't seem spectacularly fast, but he won races. And you could rely that he's not going to do anything stupid. Hunt stormed back in France and after a disputed start, took the checkered flag before a home crowd in Britain. The victory James, they've changed the regulations concerning the wings, and yet you're still extremely fast. How do you do it? Big balls. <laughs> Forget it. Can't they prove that? <laughs> <laughs>